Not as I've seen him play in this couple of years. And here's Rod Smith out in the open field. Eludes one man, lowers his shoulder inside the 20 yard line. It's great. Rod Smith made a, did a great job getting to the sideline immediately. That's what you want to do on screen plays. All of the action going one. <laughs> Third down. Trying to find somebody open, and there's somebody open. Terrence Williams. But obviously right there, Marcus, it paid off. Absolutely, and Dak was patient. You take it all the way into the sideline. Unless you feel like you have, you're under too much pressure, you got to get out of bounds or throw the ball out, out of bounds. Dak did a tremendous job. One to 332. Cincinnati with 10 yards, two possessions. We get more than that here. C.J. Uzoma. Big tight end out of Auburn. Past the 30 to the 31-yard line. Cincinnati's got about eight of them. <laughs> nice job there. That goes back to Andy Dalton. You know, again, I always, you got to go to the Matthew Stafford school of finding arm angles. And the Tyrone Crawford communicating about possible games. Yep, yep. Third down. Dalton escapes. Has the first down. Up to the 48-yard line for 54. Jeff Driscoll. Quarterback for Cincinnati had a nice week a week ago. Ball is loose. It's still loose, and the Cowboys come up with it at midfield. Byron Jones wound up with it. By the defense, first down. It was Kayvon Frazier that had the first crack at it here. Here you see Kayvon coming in trying to scoop it, scoop it. Almost gets his knee taken out right there. You know, they talk. You can't run your offense the way you want to run it, so a sack would be huge at this point. Dorrance Armstrong, the right defensive end, fourth round pick out of Kansas. Cheeto Arousier. Wow. Cheeto skies for that one. <laughs> I watched a lot of Colorado football, and Cheeto might have been able to have about 15 interceptions. His last year, if he hung on to the ball, I never saw anything like this. Maybe that's the key, Marcus. Maybe he just needs to go one hand on one hand. You know what the difference is? He's wearing number 24. That's He's that. wearing Everson Walls number right. 24. So he comes down with the interception. You can bring it from inside. And Driscoll has Erickson on the sideline, has the feet inbounds. What a pickup for Cincinnati. Take a look at him. Dallas is challenging the ruling on the field. One down of a completed catch. Maintaining Time possession. Out. I think he's got it. Well, they ran it around in the Rose Bowl. Against the Big 12 team. Trey Carson towards the goal line. And there's the signal. He's in for the touchdown. Liberty Ilo's Trey Carson with the touchdown. <laughs> I do like the fact that they let him be a little expressive after they score. His own version of the icky shuffle. <laughs> that knee did not get to the ground, did it? I think the knee was on another player. It will not be a tie game Jeff after this play. To the back of the end zone, taking a shot was John Ross, and he holds on for the two-point conversion to make it an 11 to 10 Cincinnati lead. And good last week too, Jeff Driscoll did. There's John Ross in the slot, 15, and boom, Jamil, Jamil showers. showers. Yeah, as basic as they can, so these guys can, so we can see if our seventh and eighth guys on this team or not. There's Lance Lenore. Catches the pass from Mike White. That's a first down for the Cowboys inside the 40. Like technique to me. What, what's your observation of Chad's screen right now? Tra he's, he's has no confidence. You know that, Marcus. You and Babe, you can see that. Of the seasons from 52 yards. <laughs> it's like, can I get a chippy? Yeah, Barkley dumps it off. Motoring down the sideline and caught from behind by Tapper down at the 15 yard line coordinator for Cincinnati again he took over two games in last season but he loves to screen probably nobody screen will screen more than he will or have it called and work to perfection there it's funny screen is a hard thing to coach up and coordinate you can't uh well Willie and coach Nick Saban was my coach at LSU he he was willing to let me play both I think in the back of his mind he knew that that football season the practice